It, it is, and I think <clears throat> I think that's one of the most interesting um, things. I know that a lot of the um, a lot of the the material created by Adobe, you're able to source back where those images and what were the reference images used, and I think that's something that is going to continue to develop and, and, and is going to be something, I suspect there'll be a standard that's adopted by every, um, or at least by most, most large language models and most AI providers, which allows you to trace back the, the content that was used as the origin for your image. Because I think otherwise, um, you're going to start to see the progress and the development slowed down by court actions and things like that. So I think there has to be a resolution to that at some point. But I also think that <coughs> the point about you know, you're using AI to do previs. We do, we use AI a lot to, to pre-build. We, we used to build prototypes and so on. Now we do all of that through, through AI because it takes us two minutes rather than two weeks. Um, but I think there's then the, the ability to truly control those pre-visualizations into the AI. And that's also something I think is, is one of the areas that's still being developed where at the moment, you can get some, you, you can give it a prompt of an image or a video and you can then create something that is based on that, but if you try to do something over an extended period of time, or it drifts away from it, and you can see where different content's been generated differently. And I think building tools and algorithms that allow you to truly control that content in, in the way that, that you want to is, is definitely one of the things that, that a lot of companies are focused on, and it's really important to achieve. The, you know, the, the breakthrough that people are talking about in terms of it being able to, to truly create audio, video, and so on. You've got to have that level of control as a creator that you have with all of your other tools as well. Mm -hmm.